what would be a couple of recommendations which you would give to you know uh, a young developer or or somebody who is you know um, who has taken up software engineering and and it's been like less than 2 years sure so basically my top 3 points would be starting from don't be the smartest person in the room that's so important for you second thing would be actually record everything you do i don't mean record like a video record record the time that you're doing so if you're working on a module if you're working on a component if you're working on a project time that how much time you're working and you know what this does is it gives you uh, you know a flow that uh, with what flow you're doing and in days to come you actually start to compete with yourself because that's something that i have done so i was like i have worked for 10 hours today i would work for 11 tomorrow so that gives you a competition with yourself which is actually a good thing and i can, i would actually like recommend uh, application if you want to do that again it's not sponsored of course yep. uh, there is an application called boosted it's on android it's not for ios but the thing that booster does it it's actually manual so it's a manual effort but yeah it is worth it i would say this so what you can do is you can create your projects and then you can time different different actions that you're doing in those projects so what i generally do is i create uh, i track my modules if i'm working on a uh, let's say authentication module i would time that how much time it took me to create the authentication module and in the next project when i'm building the authentication module i would actually compare this time that last time it took me you know let's say 15 uh, sorry 15 hours this time it took me 12 hours so obviously i'm doing better so yeah this gives a clear track of time of what you are doing so that's something i would recommend and the third thing that i would uh, recommend is to invest in yourself and i don't just mean time of course you should invest your time i would also say money i would say if you want to you know be in this technical job you need to have a website it's always helpful for you so build a portfolio give time to it give 50 hours give 40 hours whatever time you need to give it and pay money for it you know actually i'm not saying to advertise it i'm saying get a good book don't create something like dot versal app or com that's not good so that you believe in yourself so i would also uh, i'll also go ahead to say that buy google works as uh, a subscription so that you also have a professional email focus on your social media try to create personal brand you know don't associate yourself with a company or with a product that yeah uh, you know somebody has built this product personal brand yourself you know create a brand of yourself which is you know obviously going to help you in, in the long run and that's something that i'm trying to do i have not done this yet i mean i have uh, my website i have my professional emails but i am now starting to you know uh, do some personal branding i'll maybe i'll start posting something on my uh, social media accounts mm-hmm. so yeah that's something that i will obviously recommend Cool, Leo. Amazing, man. Love all these three things, and I can, you know, totally relate with these as well. Uh, super, super helpful. But thanks again, Ustha, for taking our time and and sharing all these golden nuggets with us. And really, really excited for your journey ahead. Thank you so much, Ayush. Thank you so much for giving me this opportunity. <laughs>